Hi guys, welcome to our Sims Free Play Advent Hints, Tips and Tutorials. Every day on the run up to Christmas I'm going to be sharing with you a little hint tip to do with Sims Free Play that will hopefully help you play the game better. Today we're going to look at how we can pause a Sims life and stop them from ageing. To be able to pause your Sims life you need to have completed the Life, Dreams and Legacies quest. Once you complete that your Sims will begin to automatically age. Before you complete this your Sims don't age automatically. You have to bake a birthday cake and age them up to the next stage in their life. For example if you have a preteen in order for them to become a teenager you would have to give them a birthday cake and then they would have a birthday and become a teenager but once you complete the life dreams and legacies quest your sims start to age automatically. To pause a sims life you need to use a platinum orb and you can get platinum orbs by completing life dreams which I will talk more about in a second. If you look at my sim tracker you can see that some sims have a grey circle around their heads and that means that they have been paused. You can look along and some of them have a green circle that means that they are aging and when that green circle reaches all the way around it will turn red and they will be ready to age up to their next cycle. So Freddy Twilight here is about a third of the way done and once that goes all the way around he will change from an adult into a senior. For my sim tracker, if we go to the fourth tab along, that is the life dreams tab. And we can see in here any of my sims that are working towards a life dream. I've only got, well, one actually at the moment. We have Melissa, the second one along here, who is working towards a entertainer's bronze life orb. There are four different life orbs. There are bronze, silver, gold and platinum. When you're in your create a sim menu, you can give your sims different personalities, sporty, geek, entertainer and animal fanatic. To begin with, with this, you won't have any life orbs, but as you continue through, you will collect life orbs. If we go into the sporty life orbs, you can see I have a ton of bronze, I have a ton of silver, gold and a platinum sporty life orb. You will just upgrade your orbs as you go along. So your first sim, you will just choose a personality and they will work towards a bronze life orb and then when they die you will give the bronze life orb to another sim and they will work towards getting a silver life orb when they die you will give that silver life orb to a different sim and they will work towards getting a golden life orb and then when they die you will give that golden life orb to a sim who will work towards a platinum life orb and when they die you will eventually get a platinum life orb. Platinum life orbs are extremely hard to get. So I definitely think carefully about which sims you want to pause their life before you go ahead and use a platinum life orb because they take a long long time to obtain. Once you have gotten your platinum life orb in order to pause your sims life if you go into the age control tab and you can see that some of my sims have this infinity sign next to them so the first two Melissa Sanders and Craig Adams have an infinity sign that means that they are paused. If we go say to Oscar he is the sim that we want to keep as a toddler if we click on the pause we can choose an orb to give him. Now you can use bronze, silver or gold but they don't pause the age completely. So if we click on a bronze that will pause for three days. You can stack these as well so if you wanted to give them more than one bronze life orb. So that's going to six days, nine days. The silver life orbs pause the aging for seven days. The gold life orbs pause aging for 16 days but the platinum ones are the ones that pause it for infinity. When you click on it you will get this little infinity sign. If you click on the tick it will ask you are you sure you want to use these life orbs to pause aging on Oscar Rossa? We'll say yes we do. You can see that Oscar now has that infinity sign next to him. If we click on that infinity sign you can resume aging if you want. I don't really see why you would want to do this in all honesty. Like I said platinum life orbs are very difficult to get and so if you kind of used one on a sim I would recommend like, like I said really think hard about which sims you want to pause the aging on. I tend to try and get a sim of a male and a female of all the age ranges. For me that is more so about showcasing if we win new clothes and things. For videos I can then showcase the whole variety of clothes but for you you can pause sims aging on whatever you want if you would like to have a sim of all, gen all genders, both genders. <laughs> and of all the age ranges as well. Of course you can do that or you can just do whatever you like. If you have a sim that you really like, that you designed really nice and you would like to keep that sim in your town, go ahead and pause their life. 
once you have paused their life you can age them up if you click on the kind of circular arrows next to their face you have the age controller where you can advance to the next stage if you would like this one costs two lps to do this this always does cost lps but i think the amount varies depending upon the age range that you are wanting to take them into and that is how you pause a sim's life i hope this has helped you out i realize that life orbs is a bit of a complicated issue for a few people especially if you're quite new to sims free play i will maybe try and make another video all about life orbs but i do think that once you complete the life dreams and legacies quest that quest kind of does explain all about life orbs but i'll try maybe and make a video about that if you would like let me know down in the comments Thank you so much for watching, I hope this has helped you out, give the video a thumbs up if it has. If you could comment down below any other things that you would like me to talk about in these Sims Free Play hints and tips, that would be fantastic. Thank you for watching and I will see you guys tomorrow for another video. Bye!